Good morning, speaker. Hi. I'm the- Lily, damn it! Where's my coffee? Delaney! It's in the fridge! It's in the fridge! I put it in there! Really? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. You want the keys? Here. 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 Mm. I drink that good. It's super good today. You're gonna love it. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Have fun, okay? Alright. <laughs> Sorry. Good morning, Speaker High. I'm Lily. And I'm Maya. And this is your THS Morning Report. Today, for Hispanic Heritage Month, we feature Richard Cavazos. Texan and Mexican-American Richard E. Cavazos was the first Hispanic person to become a four-star general in the United States Army. He graduated from Texas Tech University and went on to serve in the Korean War as the commander of the 65th Infantry Regiment. He then served in Vietnam as commander of the 1st Battalion, 18th Infantry Division. Cavazos became the first Hispanic four-star general of the United States Army in 1982 and received a number of military honors including the Distinguished Service Cross, the Silver Star, the Bronze Star, and the Purple Heart. Cavazos died in San Antonio in 2017. Seniors, the Rudd Scholarship is now open. The Rudd Scholarship is a four-year, full-ride scholarship that covers your tuition and fees, books and supplies, and room and board. This scholarship can be used at Wichita State, Kansas State, Emporia State, and Fort Hayes State. Forty of these scholarships are awarded to Kansas students each year. Check the Senior Google Classroom or talk to your counselor for more information. Topeka High will be giving the ASVAB test on November 14th in the library to interested sophomores, juniors, and seniors. The time is to be determined, but will take place in the morning. If you're not interested in the military, that's okay. All students are encouraged to take the test as it evaluates one's personal skills and abilities. It's a free, standardized test that helps you determine what you're good at. If you're interested, fill out the form that is in the Counseling Google Classroom or in your Synergy email. Sign up to take the ASFAB test. We'll close November 1st, 2023 at 3 p.m. Welcome back to Whatcha Eating. What are we having for lunch today, Jazz? Chicken bites and dinner roll. Mr. Piazza, what are we having for lunch today? Crispito. What are we having for lunch? Mac and cheese and cornbread. Hi, Miss Crohey. What are we having for lunch? Cheeseburgers! Thank you. <laughs> what are we having for lunch? Mashed potatoes and gravy. Thank you. And what you're Speaking of food, come to an end on the fun of market day in the dungeon tomorrow during both lunches. If you're a little groggy, head up to the Trojan Cup for a caffeinated drink or fruity beverage. They're open before school and during both lunches. If you're wanting to get your grades up as we finish quarter one, or just want a quiet place to study with tutors available, the PM Academy is open to help you out Monday through Thursday from 3 to 4.30 in the student cafeteria. Remember to bring in old, used, or broken toys to the library. They can use these items for their Franken Toys event in October. And now for upcoming events. JV Women's Tennis at Hayden. BJ signing in the cafeteria. JV Volleyball versus Topeka West and Washburn Roll. And now for shout outs. Shout out to Scholars Bowl for winning Clash of the Clubs and NEHS for placing second. And that's all we have for you today, Topeka High. Towers up. That was awful. You guys are boring and no fun. We ate, Paulo. Okay. We literally oh, ate. Man. We had no. We were good.